Oh my god, be good. Go in the hole. Go, go, go. Hello. Oh, wow. That's one of the greatest <laughs> scramble birdies the world has ever seen. Do it right now. That's so good. Do it right now. Do it. Do it. All right, guys, welcome back. Today, I'm here at Archfield, one of my favorite places in the whole of Scotland. I'm playing the Dilton Golf Course. Now, this golf course is tight. It is full of hazards and obstacles. And to be honest with you, I think I would shoot a million around this golf course today on my own. So therefore, I have enlisted the professional services today for a special edition of Break 65. Everybody, Mr. Peter Finch. Oh, this is going to be good. How are we? This is going to be fun. We're going to shoot a billion and one now, aren't we? We are. <laughs> yeah. So this is a par 72, 6,600 yards off the tees we're playing off today. Um, and you'll notice Peter is mm. going to be hitting this golf club a lot today. Yeah. Because what happened to your driver yesterday? I had a little whoopsie yesterday. Um, I smashed the face in, well, out of my Stealth 2 Plus. Second one this year. Not in anger. Nope. In pure power. It's really frustrating because it's a great drive as well. Like a proper low spinner, 400 yarder down the hill. I was like, I finally cracked it. But no, it was just the face. So we're going to play today Scramble. You know the format. We both tee off, we choose the best ball, and we both hit from there. And we continue that until we make a handful of birdies and shoot a 65. The only thing I'm a little bit mm. concerned about, a little bit, Pete's hitting three wood. I'm going to be hitting driver. I feel like he's going to outdrive me. Most of no, 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 no. Today, you <laughs> are the distance boy. Like, oh, you can what? just smash it. I'm going to hit some little piddlers down there with this still too. Just find, just find a few fairways. It'd be good. What's our chances, Pete? Um, 65. Have you actually played here before properly? With you about nine years ago. So, this, <laughs> with... I, I, I don't know how much drove stuff you've done, but basically, like, this hole, this is the widest hole on the course. Okay. It usually, <laughs> you've got fairway, gorse. Oh, really? That's it. Wow, okay. So, we're in for a treat. Yeah. So, let's kick things off. 399 yards, par four, first hole. Uh, do you want me to go first? Mate, lead the way. All right. Oh, pull it straight, left. <sighs> well, you said you'd be the fairway finder today, so that's yeah, the plan. I didn't, want, I didn't want to have to do it on the first hole. So Pete was saying this is the widest hole in the golf course and I've just put it straight in the gauze bush. <laughs> Strong start. Wow. What's the bit? That is the most nervous over a golf shot I've been in quite some time. Just, just, just hold on a second. I want to check two things. First, is this legal? Because that actually went a country mile. Second, you've been you've been working out. Yeah, mate. That was a that was ripped. That is an unbelievable opening tee shot. It's one good thing about three wood though. You can smack it. Love that. Right. Thanks, Pete. Thanks for rescuing the whole video. That way. <laughs> just this is just going to be the whole round, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm not even going to bother teeing off. You know, are you inviting me here on the false pretenses? <laughs> I might not even get one of my shots played today. <laughs> Great tee shot, Peter. 135 yards to the flag. Pin is kind of right side of the green. Mm. From memory, and again, I know from the other golf course here, the Fidra, a lot of the greens are kind of like upside down saucepans. So if you don't land it on, it can run off. Yeah. Right, come on then, Pete. Let's open up the account with the birdie. Okay. What are you going to go with? Thinking, a little wedge, just left of the flag. Slight cut spin, rip it back to the hole. Love it. Oh, he's absolutely done it. Oh, Go. stay. Oh, yay. That was really that close. Really good. That was really <laughs> that close. Good. I'm going to go pitching wedge two. Pretty much a full one for me. Uh, don't want it to spin too much because, as you saw from Pete's, it'll kind of screw off the front of the green. Travel, hooking, hooking, travel, hooking, 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 hooking. and spin left. Oh, I didn't quite get there. Ah, hit yours, Peter. You're not doing yours? I want to I I see this chipping in action. 
I want to see this release, mate. Well, this this won't be this won't be chipping even from here. No, I think yours. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of straight up the hill there. I think I probably should take my chance when I can to get a shot on the scorecard today, but we've got time. Pete's taking us through his first hole nicely. All right, birdie opportunity here on number one. Slightly up the hill. Probably doesn't look like there's loads and break. A little no. bit left if going anywhere. Yeah, I think it's, it might move a little bit that uh, to the right going up the hill, but it's going to be probably at a pace. Hey, listen, I'll, I'll let it straight. That went straight left, didn't it? Wow, and that, I hit that hard as well. Really? Okay. Yeah. So, a bit of intel from there. So, it's going to swing left, and it's definitely slightly more uphill than Pete anticipated. Come on, come on. Oh, Rick. Slow, isn't it? Should have learned a little bit more from Pete's there. That was a tricky one, that. Listen, we've got a guest on the channel. It's only fair if I allow that guest to shine. Early doors, build his confidence. So, not this running for par, Pete. I'm not even going to watch that confident. <laughs> this is going to go straight in the holes. <laughs> How's that a sign of confidence? Like, not wanting to watch? No, I'm not, because I'm so confident you are going to hold it. Right. I don't need to watch. Great par, Rick and Pete. Great par. Great par team. Well done, Great, great well, par team. Well done, everybody. Well done, mate. Well done. <laughs> okay, Rick and Pete. Level par, two one. <laughs> Second hole, 491 yards, par five. This is a cracking hole. I can see at least six or seven, eight bunkers down there. It's just like a very, I remember from last time, such a strategic course. Like it's not, not the longest we're ever gonna play, but there's just so much danger. Like you've got to plot your way around. Having said that on this one, you just blast the- It's gonna say, I've, I've just got bunker. driver in my mind. <laughs> right, let's see if we can actually fade on this time, not like the first. Not that much fade, Rick. Okay. Nice landing between them all. Yeah, it should be safe. One down there, Peter, so you can rock it. That power three would. Oh, Toad the arse off that. And it's gone. Oof. Okay, we're taking mine. <laughs> Good dovetailing. Yeah, it's part of the. Uh... Part of the contract I signed. At least one t shirt on the front and back now. <laughs> You're right. Okay, so my t shirt was actually fine, only just off the fairway. 245 yards to the flag here on the par five. It's actually sat very nicely. I'm going to get a three wood on this. You still got that Cobra three wood? Absolutely. And I still can't particularly hit it, but <laughs> it's in there. Go Keep on, drawing. Get a ground draw. Whoa, Simmer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's pretty good though. Yeah, it wasn't quite the height I was looking for. Strike. Dig your teeth in. <laughs> that actually flew a lot further than I thought. That's actually not bad. We both come through the back of the green here. However, mine is on this bank. And that's going to be a, a nasty little shot where Pete's is much more flatter lie, a tiny bit further away, but a much easier golf shot. So let's go with this one. I kind of feel we need a, need a bird here. So it's flat calm in the morning. Got to take advantage while we can. Let's do it. So not, like I say, loads of green to work with, fairly flat. That there. Wow, that is took off. Well, to some degree, you did exactly what you asked yourself to do. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to do not too dissimilar, just go a little bit more height. Oh, thin it. Shot. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, still getting used to these, this chip in malarkey. Okay. Still getting used to it. Okay, so the moment. First, that's a long range putt for birdie, but I feel like we need to get on the part early at this round of golf. Come on, give it a good chance. Hit it. Oh, what a line. Hit it. Right, nothing to lose. I can go straight at it. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, that did not move at all. How did that not break? It was a good putt. Yeah, it was. I was really surprised that didn't break. Right, 
par uh, on the card on a par five. That really stings. Okay, third hole, par three. Uh, a couple of bunkers down the left-hand side. It looks like the pin is up on a top tier. Playing 191 yards. I'm gonna see if I can kind of muscle draw a six iron in there. That's a fat six. That's a shame, because that's bang on line. All right. So that was a chunky six. Yeah, that's done better than I expected. Because I had no right, no right at all, getting Get on the green. <laughs> Hello. Oh, 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 he loves. I'll do. He loves that fade. That was absolutely epic. Come on, partner. Let's get this going now. Come on. If you saw, which I'm sure many of you did, the golf bit of video we released earlier this year, if you've not checked it out, there's a par three down the hill and Pete hit that shot twice in a row, both nines, and they were just they were just different level. Right. Wonderful, wonderful, spectacular, splendid iron approach there from Peter Finch. Set us up with this very nice chance at birdie here on number three. And this green is big. My ball was on the green, but it was a long way back. So get on the par, first attempt here. Come on, let's just take the one. Ooh. I pulled that. Okay. <laughs> Come on, the first birdie. Oh, it's not. I hit that really nice. That was a really nice putt. Why aren't your putts breaking? You're so much lost. I kind of sliced straight, it. Straight <laughs> up. <laughs> oh, in for par. Oh. Damn. Right. No birdies yet. But Three pars. Do you feel we're trending that? I feel so like, like we're getting closer to the yeah. hole each time, and the benefit this next hole is a drivable par. Oh. Fourth hole, 312 yard, par four. It's slight dog leg to the right. There is a bit of a stream that runs down the right hand side. Um, I kind of wish right now that Peter Finch had a driver in his bag. No, no, I can still make it. Okay, well, doesn't need driver apparently, right? <laughs> <laughs> so just straight over the corner here, just yeah, straight at it. Those bunkers with a fade, I think. Oh my God, be good. Don't know Please if I hit it well good. enough. Go in the hole. Go on, bounce. Go, 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 go. Front edge. Great shot. Hello. Oh, partner. Hello. Wow. Right, Pete, I've given you full license to go straight we'll up at with this. the three wood. <laughs> straight, yeah. <laughs> to knock it past me with the three wood. Is it good? If it has a massive skip. It did have a massive skip. It is literally over the back of the green. Yeah. That first hop was like a rocket. Too much club. Should have hit five wood. <laughs> okay, eagle put here on four. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the video. This is where it starts. Okay, fourth hole. As you can see, we've got just on the front edge. This is how we open our under par account with a nice little eagle on here. Oh, I pushed it. Straight, yeah, I pushed it. Came off the face straight right a little bit annoyingly. This cannot finish short of the hole, Peter. I don't, you know what? No. I don't, I, I don't know why I listen to you. Why? Don't leave it short of the hole. That is something a golfer <laughs> says to themselves in their own head before they blast it. Well, 20 foot pass. Welcome to my brain, Peter. <laughs> I, don't, I don't like it in there. Really. I, don't, I, don't wanna, I, don't, I don't want to be part of that. Neither do I, mate. Neither do I. Right, so first birdie, pretty straight. Oh, is that a full Rick Shields hole there? Wow. Player. Don't rely on me for the birdies, Pete, don't you worry. Right, Rick, one on the par. <laughs> oh, wow, you know what? I, I knew this was going to happen eventually. I knew at some point I'd be edited out and I'd slowly be just like left off screen. Right, one under for Rick and Pete. We're in now. Yeah. This is where it starts. Got our iron. Fifth hole, par five, 510 yards. Beautiful. It, honestly, this golf course, you hear great things about Archfield, you really do, but 
The condition of it today is just, is actually pristine, it's perfect. It's pure, isn't it? It's absolutely pure. Um, probably requires a drawer off the tee, but nah. Blast it over the corner. Not that good. Ricky Shields, what's with the driver at the moment? Peter, it's on you, my friend. Anything. It's on the line of the bushes, but it kind of looks like it. Yeah, I'm optimistic there. Might open up. I'm optimistic. All right, so we are here <laughs> in the trees after hopefully finding Pe Peter's golf ball. We didn't, it was gone. No. We found my golf ball, however, uh, and it's this is what we faced with. <laughs> right. So the actual pin is down that way. Looks like it's 300 yards away. Now, normally, the shot would be to try and almost punch it straight through that gap. However, <laughs> this tree trunk, immovable object. Is it loose? It's definitely dead, isn't it? You'll have to do that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, my God, what would it be here? Here we go. Oh, I got it. <laughs> Which way are you going, though? <laughs> Just go this way. <laughs> oh, it's going to impede our swing this way. <laughs> what are you going to do with it? Uh, I mean, that gets it a little bit further away. <laughs> hold it there, Pete. <laughs> Pete, hold it there while I hit. Hold the crossbar. I mean, I think this is the furthest it's going to go. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh. Told you it's been working out. <laughs> yeah, by doing this. This is all I've been doing. You might want to give your hat a shake. <laughs> so I'm going to chip out this way. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I don't. I just don't think you can get it. No. There's, there's no way you're going to be able to keep it that low that far. You could. You... you could without the, the trunk. We could try and shift it. No, a bit. I don't think you can. No fair dues. No, you know what? I'm in the wrong profession. Eh? Fair dues to the guy. <laughs> wow. Oh, Wonder what. I wonder why you got me here. That was very impressive. I'm somewhat aroused. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's go for it now then. <laughs> I feel somewhat of a pressure. Great shot. It's got out. Did it get past that bit of yeah, rough Yeah, it, it's just in the semi. Okay. Great shot. Thanks, pal. Right, okay. So I'm going to try and hit it low. I'm just going to smack it through this first one and hopefully get a bit of a rise. Yep, just what I thought. It's too much topspin. <sighs> Happens sometimes. <laughs> oh. I, was, I didn't. Like me normally hitting a fade, as soon as I looked up, those two trees were like, we're going to hit you in the face. <laughs> okay, third shot now on this par five. And actually, we've still got a long way in, 240 yards. Uh, pinned slightly up the hill. Big, huge mouth of a bunker protecting the front entrance of it. I'm going to try and smash the three wood at it and hopefully it runs up the hill. Missed the bunker somehow. Keep going left, keep going left, keep going left. Go, 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 go. Wow. Very good. That's really good. I couldn't do much better than that. I'm not going to lie to you. We've got one up there. I don't still look, it's not on the green, so there's definitely room to get closer. But not an easy shot. Go on then. I'll do something similar to mine, but even better. Go on. I tell you what, that's whoa, 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 breaks now, breaks now. Very good. That'll do. Very good. You know, from there, they were two very good shots, right? <laughs> you won't believe it. After <laughs> two terrible tee shots, two not great second shots, we've managed to recover slightly and we've got a birdie outside birdie opportunity here on hole number five i'll tell you what this would be a birdie for the ages if we managed to scoot one in here i think after the way this hole has gone so far it has to we have to birdie yeah got a bit birdie written all over it it was uh, to be honest like i was so relaxed over that book i just knew 
It just had to happen, mate. That is ridiculous. That's one of the greatest <laughs> scramble birdies. Not just Archerfield, not just Scotland, not just Europe, but the world YouTube has history. ever seen. YouTube history, mate. Sixth hole, we feel like it needed to catch our breath a little bit after the adventures of the fifth. 380 yard par four. Uh, you're absolutely right with this golf course. There's not a lot of places to miss. Just imagine this with wind. Okay, so I'm just gonna try and hit a big butter cut off those that left fairway. Yeah. Beauty. Go on. Okay, Pete, the floor is yours. We're in a good spot. Very nice. Yeah, I could draw it in there. I know, that was really nice. Oh, that's awkward. It's awkward, but also not, un not unexpected. <laughs> <laughs> He's just carried his three wood past my drive. Okay, unbelievable three wood shot, Peter. I did, I did smoke that, by the way. I don't want to. I'm, I'm glad I, I didn't quite catch mine. All right. I was only, listen, because I picked my golf ball up before anyone saw it, it was only five yards behind Pete. How far have we got left, pal? <laughs> 70, 70 yards. Okay. I like how supportive I'm trying to be. If we were playing each other in the match, man, I'd be, I'd be dancing up this. Oh, you would have, you would have been putting, you would have been making sure I knew how far you just hit that three would pass me. Right, 70 yards. Let's make something happen. Let's see if we can make three birdies on the bounce. What are you hitting? I think a lob wedge, 60 degree, just half a swing. Strike, Skip. hop, stop, and stop. Okay, so I'm gonna go lob wedge as well. I'm gonna try and fly it there. New wedges, so it might spin a little bit more. Oh, that's big. Some things don't change, Peter. It's great playing with Rick, it's like a it's like a comfort blanket, like being wrapped around you. Like things just don't change in reality. You know, a lot of things just stay the same and constant. Blue three wood, can't fade it. Wedges go a long way. <sighs> At least I'm consistent. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> Birdie, look here on number six. Up the hill, right to left. I'm happy, more than happy, Pete, for you to take this solo. You've hit a wonderful drive. You've hit a great second shot. For three in a row. Three in a row. Well done, mate. Nice solo birdie. Right, looking good this now. Six holes played, three under par. Seventh hole, par three, 169 yards. Slightly downhill, slightly down breeze. Back left pin position. Should be absolutely right in my wheelhouse. I'm gonna go eight iron. This just looks so good for you. Got a good feeling here. Oh, I've not hit it well enough. Get back there. Look in. Go on, trundle, trundle. Yeah, it was just a bit bottom groovy. I could tell straight away I hadn't got every bit of oh, it. I got it. We're safe, we've got an opportunity. We've got a look for, a long range look for our fourth birdie in the row. However, the way Pete's been playing his iron shots. Well, I think if I go eight, I can actually just like start it out the pin. And like if it cuts a bit, then wind yeah. will hold it, so. I like it. Stay there, wind. Be good. Wow. I don't know why I tried to take so much off that. Overthinking it, mate. Two on the green, not particularly close, but you never know. Long putt may, may be held. Okay, so down on the green, they're actually, I mean, they're not great, but mine's not terrible. I think mine's just a tiny bit closer, we'll go with mine. By the way, check out that. Archerfield House. Apparently when this golf course was being turned back into a golf course, that particular building was derelict. And part of the process of bringing Archerfield here was to actually renovate Archerfield House and they've done an incredible job. Now if we can go four birdies in a row, well then. Pulled it. Ah. So just more of a straight pull? Yeah, or? I just pulled it. I honestly don't see a lot of break in that, Pete. Nah, it's pretty straight, isn't it? Oh! <laughs> Wowzers. Oh. Wowzers. 
it did, I mean, I pushed that slightly, so it definitely had a little bit of right to left in it. In for par, no harm done, three under through seven. Eighth hole, 358 yard, par four, looks tight and straight. Um, it just, we just need to find fairway, let's be honest. At this point, it's fairway or nothing. Play it. I'll do. Oh, wow. That took a weird second kick. bounce, but. That'd be all right. Just in the left rough. Just didn't quite cut back. Maybe I should have teed it a touch lower. Right, Pete. That's not too bad, but I think. Looking at the control into these greens, fairway is definitely a more. Yeah, yeah. We'll just sit down a little bit, don't we? Yeah. Hold that line. Stay like that. Land on the fairway and stick. Well, thanks for listening, Ball. Yeah, well. Nice shot, pal. Very well behaved. <laughs> <laughs> and very nice shot. But I feels like it's going almost a little bit too well at the moment. Still plenty of birdies to go. We've got to get to seven under to shoot 65, so yes, we're doing well, but definitely more bird is needed. Right, 87, what are you gonna go with? Uh, 54, over the top of the pin, spin it back. Love it. Strike. Do exactly what you said to do. Spin, screw. It was a good strike, but it didn't, it didn't feel like a spinny strike. No. Okay, so 87, and then you go 55 degree sand wedge. Not a full one, a little three quarter one. Let's see if we can get it closer than Pete's. Oh, where's that gone? Seriously, where's that gone? <sighs> I'm, I'm confused about that one. Even, even me, oh. of all the wedge shots I've hit long, I'm confused about that one. Okay, so 300 currently. I feel like we're doing all right, ticking along. I'm racking up some birdies. That's oh, just your head. Away. Just at the end? Yeah. So that was pretty, pretty dead weight. He moved about a hole. Come on. Go, 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 go. Not, I don't feel like I'm quite getting the speed right. Oh. Not quite getting the speed. Good par pal. No harm done either. Yeah, two pars back to back. So I mean, it feels quite like sedate. Yeah. Need some energy, need some birdies, the eagles. You need to start lifting some more trees. <laughs> <laughs> Ninth hole, 427 yards, slight dog leg left. Come on, Rick. Get the old driver working. We're trying to hit a draw down here. There he is. See, that's a proper goal shot, that. Look at that. I don't even need, I, you know, that's just, that's just Rick being Rick. That's just a lovely shot, lovely shape. Right, don't embarrass me now, Peter. Don't go, don't go stick, because that was actually... Nice if if flight, he knocks it though. past it now, then fair, you know, I can't do anything. I literally have nothing left in the tank. <laughs> Unreal strike. That's stayed in the air a long time, isn't it? Really nice. You know when you watch Happy Gilmore, the film, and the, the, the special effects where it's like the ball's up in the air, and it's like zooming through the trees and it looks like it's going over the mountains and far away. It's kind of how your ball looked then. It just <laughs> looked like it was, it didn't look real. Um, can we go with mine anyway, just because it feels like I need a bit of an ego boost. <laughs> okay, 159 yards, second shot here into nine. Wind feels like it's helping if anything, but not a lot. It's kind of off the right shoulder, isn't it? Okay, I'm gonna, hit, I'm gonna hit a little, I say little, pretty much full A tie and just land it straight on it. Kick left. Hmm. Didn't really allow for a draw, and then it didn't draw. I think I'll go, let's go one less with a nine. I'll tend to hit it a little bit higher, I think. Keep coming. Oh. Yeah, I just, to be honest, like... Didn't catch it? Yeah, I just kind of came up and out of that. So. Okay, we're on the green. Opportunity for birdie. Long range opportunity here on nine. A nice way to finish the front nine. Right to left. Not a lot of slope up or down. Keep turning. Stop turning. Oh, 
Hey! Oh, oh, oh. So much of that, I man. thought it was out wide. Oh, man. Come on, Pete, to finish the front nine, four under par. Done exactly the same. Oh, Pete. You Peter. Donkey. Well, I will be your Shrek any day. Friends? Friends. <laughs> Three under through nine. Okay, I mean, I'm all for this. We have to mandatory stay here for 10 minutes. Damn. So he watches. What a shame. <laughs> Halfway house, let's go. Okay, this is a new one for the channel, everybody. A macaroni cheese pie. I mean, it looks disgraceful if I'm going to be completely honest with you. No, it looks like, like why heaven. Would put, why would you put macaroni and cheese in a pie? Why would you not, Pete? I think, I think if you didn't think about putting macaroni cheese in a pie, you were short-sighted <laughs> okay. and lack creativity. Not thinking outside the pie. <laughs> <laughs> right, and also we've got a sausage roll. So let me smash the sausage roll first. I'm going to dip a bit of ketchup in it. Okay. Very nice, quite small, but... Exceptional. Wow. So, but that, that was a quick judgment as well. Listen, I could tell by the look. As soon as it hit your palate, you were there. It's a little bit small. It's a little bit small. That, that's, that's my only criticism. Peter, what have you got? Um, I'm just going to peel back this layer. That's the steak pie and that's the scotch pie. Now, I don't actually know what's in a scotch pie. I mean, I'm imagining like haggis potato, something like that. I think haggis every day. I won't dip it in the ketchup just yet. With me. <laughs> just me. <laughs> and there you have it. Rick and Pete's food review. <laughs> just me. Just me. Fueled, ready to go. Back nine, let's go. Par five. First hole, little dog leg to the right. Um, I'm just going to try and just go straight. Stop trying to shape it. Oh. Now that's a drive. Wow. Centre stripe. Centre stripe. Love that. The old, the old papa. <laughs> I'm not feeling much quicker after them two pies, if I'm being honest with you. Great ball. Great ball. A little bit more of the corner, pretty equidistant again, I think. Yeah, just like to monitor me once a day, just make sure I'm in the right place. <laughs> he's, on the, he's on the golf course arrest. It's all right, guys. The voices haven't returned. We're all safe. What a day we live in. There's some dude arriving in his helicopter and I, uh, this morning I arrived on my bike. <laughs> Quite the contrast. <laughs> okay, second shot into 10. I'm just going to go straight at it nice and high. Oh, I've towed it. Get Say lucky. What, get lucky. Oh, get a kick. How oh, lucky. It, it's not on the green, but it's right on the front. Okay. Oh, it's actually just rolling back. Okay. And now it's rolled in the water. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, be phenomenal. Go on, travel. It will, it's there. Oh my God. <laughs> I'll take that. Take that you can have reward. it, you can have it. <laughs> Holy smoke. Scotch pie, trust me, food of champions. That, that's, honestly, Pete, not, not to blow smoke, that's one of the greatest golf shots I've ever seen you hit. Mate, blow as much smoke as you want, I'm ready for it. <laughs> I, am, I am open, I am open and I'm ready. Honestly, the height, the flight, it just didn't deviate from the target and it set us up with an incredible, and I mean that, incredible look at Eagle here on 10. Mate, we're gonna do it, we are gonna do this. Wow, that was really good. Look at this. Mini version of the Swilkin Bridge. I feel like I should allow you to continue no, to no, walk, no, no, Peter. Please, no, after you, no, no, after no. that shot, after you. Okay. okay. After you. <laughs> you deserve it. Thank you. <laughs> if I hold the port, then I can walk back over the bridge first. <laughs> so close, but literally it was up there and it went whoosh, down into the water. I'm saying this is big. Like if we actually want to break 65, like, we've got to make a few of these things happen. So, again, it doesn't look like it's going to do a lot. Yeah, if anything, it's going to go left. I'm just going to go uh, half a cup outside right. Okay. 
So my tee shot, your second shot, but all we need is one of us to hold it for eagle. <laughs> wow. It's okay. It's okay. okay. It's okay. okay. It's okay. You've secured the birdie. <sighs> wow. Don't worry, I've got it. You give me a good line. Oh, speed did keep that high. Ah! Unlucky. It's a good putt. Hey, listen, we're, you're only going to be holding, what, 5% of those anyway? Yeah. Okay, four under through 10. 11th hole, 388 yard, par four, dead straight. No room for going right or left, only fairway balls allowed. There is a ditch down there. That looks a long way down there. So let's see if we can middle line it again. Oh, you're vibing now. It's a lovely drive. Thanks. That got in the ditch. It's just like a dry, dry ditch, do you think? I'm just going to carry it, Pete. I'm just going to carry the ditch. <laughs> if you carry that ditch, then I quit golf. You can have the channel. <laughs> oh my god, I just had yachts flash before my eyes then. Oh, Monaco, here I come. <laughs> oh, sheesh. Sheesh. I, I honestly thought with that first bounce, I did. I always looked, <laughs> I I was did. Over then. <laughs> I was about to transfer the password. <laughs> I think we're both in that dry ditch. Well, we are actually both just short of this ditch, um, which is a, was a dry ditch anyway. However, <clears throat> just in the rough, 111 yards to a front pin. Oh. It's been brilliant for a pin on the right side of the green. <laughs> it did, the hey, it did go long left though, did it? What the hell? Anyway. What was you at then, 54? Well, I hit 50, tried 50. to chip a 50. It's like a solid 54. Yeah. Go, 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 go. Almost missed that. I'm sorry, Rick. Listen, I'm sorry too. We're both equally as crap as each other. Look at the distance between them two. That is bad, that is. Really, really bad. That's bad. Really bad. That's bad. Right, we've gone for... They were both terrible, but we've come for my one. Just off, just on the green, big sloping right to left putt. Oh wow, that's a big swing halfway that. Lovely pace. Yeah, good for speed. Simmer, hit the flag. Nah, just hit it way too hard through that middle bit. You went for it. You went for it, right. Well done. Another par. Okay, 12th hole, 359 yards. There is a ditch short of the green, but I personally don't think I'll get there with driver, so I'll get, I'll get one down there, put one in play, and then Pete can have a decision to make. Oh. Swing is looking lovely and in control now. A little fiddler. Give us an angle in. 86 yards to the flag, pins back right. Well, on a little good. shelf, actually. This looks, uh, I can tell you're licking your lips at this. This is my favorite yardage. Is it, what did you go with? Uh, just like a little 54, flight it down. I'm gonna go for a really spinny, flighty one. Oh, chunk it. <laughs> chunk it, float it, run it on. Hi. This is right in your wheelhouse. Oh no, Peter. I don't know what to say, Rick, I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, just off the fringe of the green, straight at it, slightly up the hill. Hit the port. Oh, God, that is straight. I just can't believe I didn't hit that. Really annoyed myself there. Is it? Straight as an arrow, that? Straight as an arrow. Boom! Boom! Let me get that for you, sir. Thank you. Well done, pal. 
Well done. Come Four, on. Five under. 13th hole. Apparently new hole, or new design at least. Par three. Lots of beautiful bunkers, and you can really see the face of them. Pin is 17 on from the front, playing 137 yards. Slightly into breeze. I think it's everything that I've got of a nine iron, to be honest. Felt like I was like, yeah. It's over to you, Pete. <laughs> oh. Yeah, nicely aboard. All right, so very new green, incredible contouring, lots of hollows and swales and slopes. It looks like it's probably cut to the same speed as the others, but I can't help but think it's going to be a fraction slower. Just a touch, yeah. Um, up the hill as well, so then you get it, once you get up the hill, it flattens out. Probably the most slope on any putt we've had so far today. Wow. Seems quite a bit slower. Yeah, he just he kind of skidded off to the right. Hit the port. That was right in the bloody middle. Still five under. 14th hole, par five, dog leg right, just under 500 yards. It looks like that big, huge bunker on the corner is definitely what's, as Pete described, protecting the dog leg. But I feel like that's what you've got to carry, really. Yeah, that's the line if you've got to. Okay, take a snap out of it. Didn't commit. All done. Uh, that's actually okay. Yeah. I, actually, I actually don't think I would have reached the bunker. <laughs> right, come on then, Pete. Sheesh. If it's over, it's bloody tremendous. Hmm. So, unfortunately, Pete, even though he went the Peter Finch line, we're not even calling it the Tiger line anymore, it's Finchy line. <laughs> Just didn't quite have enough with the three wood. So we've come back, come back to old Papa Shields, pat one down the fairway, 245 yards left to this flag, pins back left. Just want to hit like a big high three wood, get it to land soft. Oh, be good. Nice didn't get the bounce. height. Oh, I didn't get the height. You're all right though. But I think that should be pin high left, just off the green. Come on, another good look at Eagle here really puts us on track. Have you hit it? Hook. Hook! No. Oh, <laughs> just, just at the bottom of touch. Got oh. swallowed up by the bunker. We've got a really nice look at Eagle here. Up onto the green, it's then starting to break right. Do it. There's a lot of times, like three foot, four foot out, yeah. it doesn't look like it's going to break, and then it breaks it's a lot more. Away, it? Oh, Damn! Man. Come on, Pete. Ah! Damn! Ah! Okay, tapping birdie to six under. Hold on, mate. Six under par. Well, that is a narrow looking golf hole. 15th, 400 yards. It is, let's be honest, it's fairway, two yards of semi rough, and then goes bush. Wow. <laughs> Remember the uh, 17th at Conway? Yes. Where it's just lying. That's yeah, the, that's is, the vibes I'm getting. It is, right. So, main priority. A golf ball in play. All right! Oh, oh, get, oh, <laughs> get, get, your, get your six iron out, Pete. Why are you doing that to me? I don't know. Oh, that was horrendous. Oh. It's all good. Been hitting this well. It's a wide fairway. It's a wide fairway. It's a wide fairway. Wow, Peter. Baller. That might be the best one of the day, look. Well done, pal. Well done, mate. I, was, I, was, I, was, I just wanted to test you. I was, I was making sure I hit that before I could think about anything. <laughs> I was just getting in the ground and smack it. Really good ball. Wow. Well done, mate. Really good. 
Great, great drive, Pete. Thank you very much. <laughs> Two birdies need in the final four holes to break 65. This is 125 yards to the flag. Come on then, let's put one. Let's have a gimme birdie. We've not had an easy birdie all day. Got wind. Okay, comfortably aboard. 50 degree in hand. I've just got to just pepper it straight at it. Straight at it, you idiot. Well, that's absolutely atrocious. Well, actually, I know you certainly won't be incredibly happy with it, but it's... It's not bad. It's not terrible, is it? Not bad. Right, come on. Half a chance for a birdie. Oh, God, you've burnt some edges. Can't seem to get them going. Right, in for par. So, ah, after that tee shot, we should have done better. I think that's all right. I think I've accidentally cut the corner a little bit, so it should be, should be fine. Maybe in the right rough. That is not a very good shot, but doing bloody well for you. Very sociable, aren't It, it did so incredibly well for you. Chat, yeah. <laughs> we should be fine down there. That's terrible. We've got lucky. They were terrible tee shots. We both found the right rough. We are, just turn around for a second, three, two and a half yards away from out of bounds, but not out of bounds. So everything's good. 175 yards to the flag back right. Okay, come on, Shields. I've got to get one close. Hold your line. Oh, go on. Hold your line and dig your feet in. That'll do. Yeah, that flew from there, didn't it? I just think it just got a little bit unlucky there as well. It just kicked on the down slope as it hit the green. I'm going to go with six and slice it. This is your shot, like you did it. in that par three before. Oh, just hit it so straight. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, like, it. Do yeah. you think with a scramble any other day, I'm like, I'm delighted. Yeah, exactly. I'm so happy. But in a scramble when we're trying to break 70, 65, it's not that great. <laughs> so, we have selected to play Mine that just went through the back. Pin was, Pete was pin high, just a little bit further outside of the range. Right, this on. is where magic takes place. 16th hole. Go, go, go. Get in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Putter is freezing cold. I kind of just wandered, uh, wandered right as soon as I hit that. Right, tap that in, then we've just got to bird the last two. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Not two par fives to finish. Right. Come on, <laughs> we've, we've still got this. Okay, 17th hole, par three. Quite simply, not a lot to this. No. Slightly raised green, 160 yards, back left pin. I mean, it's got birdie written all over it. It's gonna hit a little flighty. Draw re a tie into that back pin. Not that much draw, Rick. Your irons at the moment are not very good. Neither are your wedges or your driver or your putter. <laughs> oh, are you? SOS, help needed. Right, nine iron. That's it. Pretty good. Please go in the hole. And sit. Spectacular. Well, I took a bit of a firm bounce. I out, did. Didn't it? Spectacular. Well done, mate. Oh, cheers, mate. Well done. I knew I could rely on you. <laughs> right. Wonderful approach shot from Mr. Peter Finch. This is it. 17th hole. Come on. Possibly, by the par fives, our most, our closest chance of birdie so far. Little eight footer down the hill. How yeah, many, yeah. How many edges? Ridiculous. Oh. Being ridiculous how many edges. Right, 
time to step up. I've not done a great deal, certainly with the putter today. This is the time. <laughs> Literally did the same with yours. Uh, that's harsh. That was really That's cruel. really, really harsh. That's golf, folks. Last hole, 409 yard, par four. Was hoping for a par five, <laughs> considering we need an eagle. However, stranger things have happened in the world of YouTube golf. So, really good drive required. Get ourselves around that 110 yard mark, and you never know, magic might happen. Oh. Oh. That's one of those where it seems like there's more space over there, but... Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, dig your feet in. Dig your feet in, white golf ball. Let's hope there's more room on the right, because that... Is that in it, is it? That looked like it pitched straight in. It like went right over the sprinkle, I can't see it. <laughs> I see it land. Oh, no. Oh. Might be all coming crumbling apart. Right. We live. <laughs> Just. Pete's, unfortunately, down the left-hand side. Mine, thankfully, just carrying to leave ourselves 139 yards left. That's all there is left between us and shooting under 65. We've got a hole this, basically, Pete. Okay. So if we can do that, that'd be great. Thanks. No problem. Um, I'm going to go pitching wedge. I feel like it might get a bit of a flyer. One hop, stop. I've hit no good shots from this distance all day, this is the time to do it. Oh, go on, just imagine. Just imagine. Just imagine. That's huge. That's massive. <laughs> That's so big. <laughs> I, gave, I, gave it, I gave it a chance. I gave it a chance. <sighs> Are you chipping a pitching wedge? Yeah. Come on then. This for immortality. That might need to get down to. <laughs> I don't think we've quite got the idea of a scramble sometimes today. We're literally hitting the same shots. <laughs> Just trying to learn from each other. <laughs> oh, never mind. I reckon if we had a third person playing, I reckon they'd be the one. Yeah, maybe Scottish Scheffler. Yeah. Let's try and finish with a bit of a strong one here. Let's try and finish with a chipping chip bird at least. Chipping bird for a 65. I mean, that'd be good. So we've both gone long, back into breeze, plenty of green to work with. Down the hill. It's actually doing very well. Yeah. Just pulled it's actually it. done really well. Just pulled it. Okay, so it's giving me a little bit more confidence that we don't have to rely on mine. <laughs> Come on, mate. Let's put these lessons in. into I'll play. Come on. Do it right now. That's so good. Do it right now. Do it. Do it. Oh! <laughs> oh! 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 That was perfect, wasn't I it? Thought that, that was I thought that was perfect. it. I thought, for once, for one time in my life, <laughs> I mean, to be honest, I'm fairly happy I chipped it closer than Pete. But <laughs> uh, <laughs> look at that. How did that not break in from there? Oh, well, you know what? Great Six, up and down. 66. Great time. Had by all. Thanks, friend. That's Appreciate still decent. That. Right, Guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Check out Pete on his channel for sure. 66. We'll live to fight another day. Thanks, Archfield. You've been beautiful. We shall see you next time. Peace.